Good morning, this is Robin Bremer with Walks with God, and I believe I'm on day number 43, I'm not sure, but it is Saturday morning or early afternoon, and my neighbors are building over there, so that's the noise you hear, and I'm getting ready to go for my prayer walk today. I got kicked out of the house by the Holy Spirit. He said, stop working on your book and go for a walk, so here I am going for a walk. Okay, here I am on my prayer walk, and this is the scripture that God's telling me to meditate on it and uh, the revelation that he's given me today that's that might set a few people free it's a uh, Luke 16 and 16 it says uh, the law and the prophets were until John John the prophet okay since that time the kingdom of God has been preached and everyone is pressing into it and that's really exciting because there's a lot of people that are walking by the law uh, okay you have to follow the Ten Commandments you do this this and this and they have the Holy Spirit's not moving in their church, they're a religious church. They just follow the laws, they try to be good, and that's great, but they don't have the Holy Spirit because they're living in the Old Testament rather than living by the Spirit. They're living by the law. And it says here that until John, it was the law and the prophets were until John. In other words, that's not an application no more. The law, Jesus fulfilled all the law. So, uh, we don't live by the law of the spirit of uh, we live by the law of the spirit of life in Christ Jesus, and we've been uh, set free from the law of sin and death, and that was where we had to follow certain commandments, and if we didn't, we were under the curse. Well, Jesus redeemed us from the curse of the law, so that the blessings of Abraham would come on us, which is all about prosperity, financial, uh, physical, money, prospering our cattle and our our fruit baskets and our storehouses and everything that we do um, that is in the Old Testament in Proverbs, uh, De Deuteronomy 28 and so um, anyway getting back to this the kingdom of God is preached so everything that Jesus did was in rel relationship to the kingdom of God he healed the sick, cast out demons, cleansed the leopards, raised the dead and uh, set the captives free and preached the gospel to the poor and that all has to do with the kingdom of God that is the kingdom of God that is um, what Matthew uh, 6.10 says that Jesus said pray this way your kingdom come you will be done on earth as it is in heaven the kingdom of God within you is what produces heaven on earth for you and everyone around you um, okay well that's my revelation for today live by the kingdom of God go look at Matthew Mark Luke and John and everything Jesus did it was in representative of the kingdom of God okay I'm Robin Bremer you're watching walks with God and that's my revelation for today I hope it's changed your life uh, or made it a little easier and uh, I pray that you get excited and on fire for God and I'm out